everybody and welcome to UVM Behind the Counter. We're here at Bell Book and Comics in Dayton, Ohio. I'm here with artist Stuart Sager and he's the artist from the newest Machete book that's out from IDW. Indeed. So how's that going? Uh, actually, I just wrapped up the first issue, going pretty well. Uh, the movie just came out, I think, yesterday, and I haven't yes. seen it yet. I, I need to go and do that. I've been busy drawing today, but the uh, book came out really pretty well. Um, it's pretty exciting in that it's a prequel to the movie. Yeah, it takes place before. In fact, we get to uh, learn from this comic how the, the, the main character becomes Machete. We oh, okay. get to see the first time he uses a machete. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's, it's a lot of fun. I did get to see the movie yesterday, so I was really impressed. I'm a Robert Rodriguez fan, like a lot of my fans know okay. air, so I really enjoyed it. I mean, blood and guts everywhere. <laughs> what else do you expect from Robert Rodriguez? I, when I saw Lindsay Lohan in the nun outfit oh licking my God. the gun, I thought, okay, all bets are off. That was something else. <laughs> yeah, so. I'm, I'm, I don't know when I'll see it, but it's probably going to be in the next couple days. So that comes out, the book comes out when? Uh, I think the scheduled release date is September 15th. Okay, is that zero first, then then it goes into a series? Are you part of that? Yeah, uh, there's there's some negotiation for a follow-up series. I don't know if that's on the docket yet. Okay. Um, there's definitely the I'm first issue coming out. Just was wondering. You know, it's, it's a good question. I know that IDW is interested in it, and the uh, Robert Rodriguez people are as well. Anytime you're working with a, a, a copyrighted character like this, there's a little bit of negotiation oh, true, back and true. forth. Yeah. And, Contracts and lawyers and yada yada. Check out the book because I've been watching it in draw today and I'm really impressed with his art. I've only been to his website just to get um, Inky. into the site or er, into his art and stuff. So yeah, he does a real good job on that. So some of it ends up on the paper, a lot of it just <laughs> ends up on my hands. So any other projects besides that? Um, actually, I got the uh, the, the uh, machete job at IDW via working for the, with them on. Um, the Death Ship comic book. Okay. And this was my first experience working with IDW, which is a four issue miniseries, and I think issue four came out this week. Oh, okay. Uh, so yeah, it's it's kind of exciting to have multiple books coming out. Oh, that's cool. Same solicitation. But this was actually uh, uh, based on a little a little gap in the story of the original uh, Bram Stoker uh, Dracula novel. Oh, okay. Um, we fill in some of the gaps in this book. It was a lot of fun. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. So any upcoming besides the machete? You know, uh, providing things get hammered out on Machete, that's probably going to keep me pretty busy. Okay. I've already spoken with the people at IDW, and they're pretty happy with me. And okay. uh, prov if for some reason the stars don't align and there's no Machete, I'm sure I'm going to be at IDW working on something. Okay. And in the meantime, it's nice to take a break. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> um, you've been on the con circuit, so you said you're going to be at Middle Ohio Con? Uh, yeah, I believe so. I wasn't able to make it last year. Um, I had done Mid-Ohio for a few years now, and okay. uh, recently some new ownership took it over, and it was a lot of fun. I, uh, I think I did, was able to do it the year before last and had my table next to Joe Kubert, which was a real oh, treat. Oh, wow, yeah. Yeah, he's awesome. I know a lot of our fans, we're going to be down at Mid-Ohio. We're going to do a bunch of videotaping down there, too, so hopefully we'll see you again we down there. We will definitely cross paths. And I appreciate the interview today. No problem. Thanks, you guys.